Tiger Designer Tiger Designer is a component of the Tiger software suite that allows you to fine-tune documents before sending them to your View Plus embosser. Tiger Designer can open files with the .prn extension, and it shows how a document will emboss by showing how dots will emboss visually in grayscale on your screen. Use Tiger Designer with the View Plus Imprint, Infuse, or a Premiere or Elite with ink attachment to preview and edit the ink and braille. This tutorial will show you how to quickly clean up a graphic, making it more useful for blind readers. To begin, open Tiger Designer by pressing your Windows key and typing Tiger Designer and pressing Enter. Or you may use the mouse to navigate the Start menu under All Programs, View Plus, and clicking the Tiger Designer shortcut. With Tiger Designer launched, open the PRN file you wish to edit by pressing Ctrl O. If you are unfamiliar with PRN files, please see the preceding video, Printing to File and Refining in Tiger Designer. Tiger Designer wants TDSX files, and you must press Tab and then arrow down to select Tiger PRN files. Press Enter, and then you need to navigate to the folder in which you saved your PRN file. Six tabs took me to the left-hand navigation pane, where I could use the arrows to select from my Windows libraries or navigate through my various drives. Press Enter when you have the folder selected, then tab to move into the right-hand pane where you can find the PRN file. Press Enter to allow Tiger Designer to change the format. Another dialog box appears prompting you to save a TDSX file. Press Enter to accept the file name and location and dismiss the dialog box. Here we have opened our diagram of a volcano. Use the pencil tool to redefine thin lines. In this example, we are redefining the vent within the volcano, as well as the outer lines of the volcano. Use the paint bucket to fill lighter areas of the diagram with white to provide more contrast in the embossed document. Here we are filling in the different layers of the volcano. We will also clean up some of the shading around the ash cloud. Now it is time to add braille labels. It is important to eliminate any tactile graphic information that could interfere with your braille label. If there is unneeded graphics in the area where you want to place your label, you can easily eliminate them using the filled rectangle tool with white color fill selected. To add your braille labels, you can use the label tool within Tiger Designer, which will add labels in computer braille. If you wish to insert grade 1 or grade 2 braille, you can use View Plus Translator. To use the Tiger Translator method, you need to start by opening a program like Notepad, creating text, and copying it to the Windows clipboard. Press your Windows key, type Notepad, and press Enter. Type your label text, press Ctrl A, Ctrl C, Alt F4, N. Tap your Windows key, type View Plus Translator, and press Enter. Check and adjust your language settings as needed, then press Alt-C and press Enter to translate the contents of the clipboard. Use Alt-Tab to return to Tiger Designer, and press Ctrl-V to paste your Braille label. You may use the arrow keys or your mouse to reposition the label. Click outside the label to accept the position you have set. Press Ctrl-S to save the changes. You may press Ctrl-Z to undo any mistakes you make. You may press F2 to toggle Combined View to show ink and embossed layers of the document combined. This will give you an idea of how it will look when printed to one of our ink and braille embossers. When you are not in Combined View, you may flip between the ink and embossed layers using the Page Up and Page Down keys. You may press Ctrl-P when you are ready to print your document. Check to see that the correct printer is selected in both the drop-downs in this dialog and select Print. This concludes our tutorial on editing graphics in Tiger Designer and adding Braille labels. To find more tutorials on this or other topics, please visit www.viewplus.com.